Hey everybody, Bird Gutter here. We are here with another one of the worst movies on YouTube. If you didn't catch that, it's and you're asking why? Why, guys? Why are you fucking having some German shit on your fucking show? Well, guess what? Our whole episode is nothing but German shit. We're going German from now on out. Yeah. Well, for this Germany. episode. Oh. The whole show is moving to Germany. That'd be kind of awesome. It would. Yeah, it would be kind yeah, of awesome. You know, beer's good. Yeah. Chicks are hot. Cars are good. Cars are great. I don't see any downside. Yeah, I don't see any downside either. <laughs> uh, so anybody out there in Germany that want to... Adopt us. <laughs> yeah, adopt some almost 40-year-old men. Well, almost, really almost 40 and slightly less almost 40, right. but... I want to hang myself. But anyway, anyway, anyway. This week we are doing Fork Lift Driver Klaus. Yeah. It's a German safety video, but is it? Is it real? I don't know. Or is it a fucking, like, parody? Because there was a lot of information and there was, like, yeah. Like, course, real yeah. information, but right. there was also the craziness that I don't want to get too deeply into right this second. It could have been real, could have been real, and they were just like, hey, let's, you know, let's, let's make it interesting. Let's make it interesting, yeah. yeah. And, uh, dude, it's, on, on all honesty, if I went to a company and I was going for a forklift driver job yeah. and they played me that, I'd be like, hey, I love fucking Klaus. Yeah, I'm like, I, I love like this thing. Like, it would put you in your the right mind for a new job. You'd be like, all right, yeah, okay, yeah. I can. This is cool. I can do this. Not like you're, not like watching Grill Skills when you're like, oh fuck, what man. the fuck is going oh, on? Grill Skills, and you're like. Yeah, but anyway, I guess we should actually get into the fucking video, right? Right. So, Klaus, this dude right here, this Aryan motherfucker right here, blonde hair motherfucker, he just passed his industrial driver's exam fucking thing. Oh, he's like, ah, oh, Klaus. Because the version we watched, there is an English dub version on YouTube, but I wanted to watch the in German with English subtitles. Right. But anyway, yeah, so he gets his fucking license or whatever, and then we get like this animated card that comes up with a forklift driving in with glibble, globble, glibble, glibble, whatever the fuck the German <laughs> word. Dude, it's a long ass word. Glibble, glibble, glibble. It's a long ass word for fucking forklift driver. It is a very long <laughs> word. But anyway, yeah, so this comes up and then it says Klaus's first day. So Klaus is at his new job, he goes to his forklift, and he does, like, you know, some checks. He's being responsible, Klaus. Well, good. You know, he's going around fiddling with this, fiddling with that, how's it steer, you know, yeah, the whole he's fucking deal. all the shit out. It looks like Klaus is on his way to doing a pretty good job, you know? Yeah. I mean, if I was there, I would trust Klaus. You know, and this, shook my head, this, far, me, yeah. this far into it, yes. You know? So anyway, so Klaus, you know, he, he decides his forklift is running fine, so he's yeah. driving into the warehouse or whatever. And some careless worker, not Klaus, but some careless worker, runs out in front of him and Klaus almost fucking hits him. Almost. But doesn't. They did. You know, Klaus was on point. So whatever, Klaus is now inside the warehouse and he sees a co-worker. So he goes up, he drives up to the co-worker and a co-worker, you know, is like, Hey, how can you help me get up to get package 16? Yeah. You ever worked at a factory and some asshole? Yes, I've there. worked at a factory, but... I know you have to. Oh, cause I'm I know, sorry. Because we were there. <laughs> the circle of it. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, because I think we both at least worked one job a piece to get, like, you know, not together, but always worked one yeah. job a week. You know, it was like, oh, yeah, I worked there. Yeah, so did I. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Ah, fuck me. But, like, yeah, but, like, you'd be there with your forklift and everything. There's no training. It's all horse shit, you know? At least it was back it in the was late back 90s. Then. Back in the day, there was no training. It yeah, was late just like, 90s, get on early there. 2000s. Oh, yeah, get on that forklift. They're like, wait a minute, I don't know how to do that. They're like, get on there. You know how to do it. Get on there. You know, you're like, oh, okay, whatever, you know? And then just learn on the job. No safety. I don't remember any kind of safety. I don't remember any but sitting me down watching a video. Like seriously, some of these places would just send you in like here these big giant clippers, you know, you can cut your whole fucking head off. You know, <laughs> yeah. use that, you know. Or there's this big machine, you know, here's the buttons, push it, you know, don't stick your hands in there. Oh, wait, I didn't tell you that. The joys of temp work. But moving on! I'm surprised there isn't like roving stories. Roving. Raving, roving, whatever. Stories is about temp uh, people, you know what I mean? Temporary employees killed everywhere because they're just thrown into these factories and they're like, do this job. <laughs> uh, okay. 
Yeah. You can weld now. Oh, really? Okay. Moving on. I'm telling you. I, I know, dude. I know. Moving on. Right, so like I was saying, dude here in the red coat's like, Klaus, can you help me get up to that fucking shelf to get Klaus. package 16? Klaus is like, no pro. He's like, no, I well, shouldn't do well, that. Well, like voice, you know, uh, German voice said, hey, you know. You mean narrator he's, he's like, oh, Yeah, narrator voice. He was like, oh, Klaus. <laughs> don't do that, you know? And Klaus was like, no, no, I'm fine, I can't do that. Conscious. So dude's like, oh, I'll just put a pallet on there. And you know, not slip it on, you know, over the forks or nothing, just lay it on the top, crooked. So Klaus is like, okay, that's fine. So dude gets on a thing, Klaus lifts him up, dude's like, go, go, block, falls, bell rings, and then we get the fucking light from police squad. da 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 -da -da -da. Sorry. I think they get it. Da -da 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 -da. Fucking Police Squad is like one of the most Dude, underrated Squad TV shows that was ever awesome. on TV. You know what I mean? They got like absolutely no respect at all. Yeah. So now Leslie Nelson's dead. Well, why do you have to put that downer on it? Because there will never be another one without him. I don't care what they do. Well, yeah. They can't replace him. You're right. They're already trying to replace Chevy Chase and all this stuff, doing vacation movie and ugh. Dude, they're working their way. They're gonna get the Goonies and they're gonna do it over. There could be some people who be like, it's awesome. What's Paul Fig gonna That's do it? That's the final fucking sword to the fucking heart of our well, but, but is Paul Fig gonna do it? Is it gonna be an all-female cast of fucking oh, Goonies? Fuck but Andy would actually be a boy this time? Ugh. Fuck you, don't make that movie. Why did you just get you the, gave you gave the story right <laughs> there? You just told him what well, direction to go. That's kind of what he does to movies recently. Oh, I'll just like you know put four women together, slap uh, Melissa McCarthy in there, done. Done. But anyway, go ahead. we cut to this dude. He's cutting open this box. Klaus pulls up. Dude sets his knife down. Klaus picks up the fucking load. <laughs> yeah. And dude, like you know, walks so away. Like, Where the fuck my knife? Comes go? back. He's like, where'd my knife go? Uh, takes yeah. his fucking hard hat off. The knife falls <laughs> off of the top well, of the Klaus load. Klaus put down the load. And it was yeah. Like, and it falls. <laughs> you plunk. Dude, right and dude's like, good. You imagine? Drops his hard hat. You'd be like, good. <laughs> you would, too. But then the bell rings for lunch, so he grabs the knife, snaps it off, and fucking... And just walks. Frankenstein's his way to fucking lunch. Well, that guy, that's dedication to lunch, dude. Like, I've, I've had, like, situations with forklifts where shit just fell on me, and I'm thank God nobody was ever around when the shit happened, you know? Like, especially when you're getting something way up top and everything's like, whoa, you're like, oh, fuck me, that's too heavy. I have a hypothetical fucking story to tell you that did not happen. Oh. Speaking of fork trucks happen. and fork truck safety, okay? Okay, good. I it's might have, but did not have this friend back in the day that used to do temp work as well. And he temp, he might have temp worked at this fucking like underground mushroom mine uh, storagey place, right? That he was the only person in this massive like underground complex. He might have been the only person be careful. in the underground complex. You know, this huge underground complex with like all kinds of crazy labs and he, there might have been labs and there might have been all kinds of forklifts everywhere and everything and that we might have but did not go to hang out with him and have forklift races. We might, might have but definitely did not have forklift races through this underground complex and and that's all the really detail <laughs> I want to get into the story well, that did not have it, it did it's not happen. It's done. It did not they happen. Know. It's already done. But anyway, moving on. Please. Back to Klaus. Klaus. Eisenman Scheiter Klaus. So, whatever, Klaus now is having problems with his forklift. It won't start. So just one of his other random douchebag fucking co-workers, not a maintenance guy or anything, is like, oh, Klaus, I can fix that. Yeah. He opens up the, whatever you would call that, the, the little hood. Yeah, the hood, I guess. <coughs> and he's all fiddling around in there, and Klaus is just sitting there waiting. And they're like, yeah, well, the narrator told him, he's like, no, Klaus, calm down, <laughs> you know, don't do anything rash, you know, and Klaus is like, ah, fuck it, turns on his, hey, it works. Yeah. Not realizing he'd, he didn't hear the bone crunch that we heard. It was a <laughs> but yeah, so it cuts back to dude, and he's sitting there with his hands still in the thing. Yeah. He pulls up his hands. Oh, Klaus was like this. Yeah. And there's, yeah, and there's no hands there. No? 
and he look at and then blood just starts spraying all over his face and all over Klaus and does it even hit the bell? Because the bell rings and then we get fucking da 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 Once again, Klaus is, is you know, he, the dude is becoming a real dangerous I know, for, he started off so fucking well. well. Yeah, I had hope for Klaus. You know what I mean? I wanted Klaus to get a raise. Yeah. I was there for him. Yeah. Whatever. But whatever, so we get an animated fucking thing telling us that you should call maintenance instead of fucking with the forklift yourself. Good advice. Good advice. So whatever, we're moving on to Klaus now is transporting a piece of sheet metal. Shittily. He doesn't secure it, does it, does it, does it just... It's just flopping. Who trained Klaus? I don't know. Really he needs to be fired. So yeah, Klaus is driving with his floppy piece of fucking sheet metal. And this dude comes out, blow, Klaus like slams on the brakes. The sheet metal flies and cuts dude in half. Oh, yeah, that's right. That's right, because he was like, you know, oh, you know, it was like, oh, God. And then the bloody bell rings, breaks, falls on fucking dude. You hear the sound effect of, oh! That is, like, the most dangerous fucking factory to work in. Like, seriously, this is, like, two, two deaths. <laughs> like in one day, you know. Not, but you were right before lunch. Well, injuries, not deaths. Well, injuries. You're cut in half. You're dead. Well, he was... Okay. Spirit through the heart, you're dead. We didn't get that far yet. But so whatever, right? So, and now we get a little animated thing saying about secure your loads. Right. Yes, good. I always... Solid secure. advice. It's solid. I always secure my loads. If that was true, you wouldn't have five fucking kids. But anyway... Right to the bone. <laughs> so now we get this office chick, right? She's walking down the hallway in her high heels and her skirt and, yeah. you know, all the dudes are like, oh, a woman. I've never seen one of those before. <laughs> so they're all, like, completely enthralled in this fucking chick, right? And yeah. Klaus is fucking driving his fucking forklift, whistles at her, looks away, and then we hear a crash. Well, you would too. You know, hot chick walk fast, you're in the forklift, you'd be turning your shit all, you know, Slamming into walls and shit. So Klaus impels this fucking yes. dude with the chainsaw. So the fucking forklift is driving and he's like, ah! Oh, Klaus, the fucking the chainsaw. Is Klaus doesn't stop. He just keeps fucking going. Because did he even notice yet? Because I think he was still looking back How at the How do you chick. not notice the dude in front, like, with a chainsaw going, ah! <laughs> but whatever, he almost hits another fucking forklift, but the fucking chainsaw, like, hits some shit that the other forklift was carrying. Something happened, And it yeah. spins around. Around and ends up cutting Klaus's fucking head off. Oh, Klaus is out. Yeah, but the forklift is still driving still fucking forward. Dude, this is the funniest shit I've seen. Uh, it was man. fucking great. This is great stuff, man. He gets the one guy and then some well, other fat dude. Well, yeah, this, this dude's out this other part of the fucking factory and, <laughs> yeah. and the narrator guy's talking about hearing fucking protection right, and right. stuff. So dude can't hear nothing. He's just like doop do doop do do and then wow, he gets Fuck. impelled by the fucking forklift like as well. Door. Yeah, but then he looks over and the other dude, he's like, Ah! The other guy's like, ah! Yeah, look at HR. He's like, hey! Ah! <laughs> you know? Yeah, so the forklift's still driving down with both of them on it, screaming their fucking, fucking awesome. asses yeah, off. But the, the great part is when the dude turns around and notices that fucking Klaus's head's, head's gone. gone. Yeah. He's like, ah! Oh, fuck! You know? Oh, that was good shit. I love it. Oh, dude, I was laughing like that. Yeah, but anyway, so the forklift is still driving by itself. It's driving down this aisleway or whatever, yeah. and there's this big piece of sheet metal sticking up. So fucking. Chainsaw dude, bloop, arm cut right the fuck off. <laughs> dude. Fucking chainsaw and the arm master. hit the fucking ground, and it the chainsaw is like, real taking the fuck off, took, right? It took the arm with it. That was yeah. Off. So it's going across the fucking floor and going <laughs> right towards fucking cut in half guy. Yeah. But it gets caught up on a hammer real quick. No, it was like, no, was it a hammer? Or was it, it was a hammer. Oh, all right. It gets caught up on the wooden handle of a hammer. And it cut right through. Yeah, it cut through that, then blah, into fucking cut in half guy. We see red fucking goo. Yeah, whatever. Good stuff, though, man. So, yeah, then it cuts back to fucking cut in half guy, and guess what? He's cut in half the other fucking way. Yeah, they, they split him. Yeah. He was like a banana split, dude. He was like, he pulled right the fuck open. So I forgot to mention that as the forklift is driving itself with the two dudes impelled, it drives right behind fucking the dude with no hands, but he has hooks now. Klaus. All in, like, the span of one day. <laughs> 
That was a shitty day to show up to work. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, that poor bastard. He probably had coffee in the morning. Probably got head from his woman. Probably feeling fucking good about himself. You know what I mean? Then he gets to work and he finds out there's a new dude on the floor. On the forklift. You know, his name's Klaus. And you're like, fuck, man, I hate new dudes. You know what I mean? Ah, fuck it. Whatever. I'll let the dude slide. So you're just walking around doing your job. And all of a sudden, <laughs> and then, <laughs> uh, uh, and then you just get carried away. Well, and because God knows where they ended up. Because the forklift goes out of the fucking warehouse <laughs> yeah. onto the road into the fucking into sunset. The fucking sunset, like a goddamn fucking western, you know? Oh my god, I loved this. I needed this so much. I mean, I enjoyed meat weed madness and all that stuff, yeah. but it was such a pain in the ass well, to edit titties. and nudity and stuff. I needed something with no nudity, and we got no nudity, but got some amazingness all the same. Oh, time. we got Klaus, and I love this shit. And I don't care if it is a real training video. If that it's was. not a real training it was video, fun. it was a good fucking time. Yeah. And I suggest that all y'all motherfuckers watch the full thing in its entirety. It's only nine minutes fucking long. Yeah, you can't go wrong with nine minutes. Forklift man. driver. Everybody has nine fucking minutes. <laughs> Klaus. Klaus. Yeah. yeah. You have anything else to say about Klaus? Not really. So yeah. I guess on that note for Burden Gutter, this has been another one of the worst movies on YouTube. We'll see you next week. Maybe. If I have the internet. <laughs> You can just email me the episodes and I'll upload them. How am I going to email them to you? I don't know. I don't. I won't have the internet. I don't know how these things work. <laughs> so I don't think I want to film today. I think I just want to sit here and play with our translators. Also, ich glaube nicht, dass ich heute filmen möchte. Ich denke, ich will einfach nur hier sitzen und mit unseren Übersetzern spielen. I agree. Bird likes huge penises. See? Are you seriously trying to translate? Bird uh, uh, uh. is a douche. Wo ist ein Saft? Where is a juice? <laughs> <laughs> I guess that's useful to know in German. I guess so. Worst movies on YouTube. Schlechtesten Filme auf YouTube. Schlechtesten what? Say it again. <laughs> we should do that whenever we do the worst. We should be like... Bird got here with another one of the schlechtesten Filme auf YouTube. Hey everybody! Well, I guess I should wait till you take your drink of fancy schmancy. Why are you drinking fancy schmancy water? Is it just a bottle? No, well, like, well now it's just the bottle. I don't know. I bought it because I was tired of all the other ones. I just wanted to try it. And they're all the same. <laughs> okay, just just making sure you weren't like they're it's all, better water. It's all bathtub water, dude. I don't give a fuck. Bathtub. Bathtub. I said bathtub. <laughs> I don't think you did, but did whatever. I? I don't know. Maybe I did say bathtub. But anyway, let's just get to Klaus. Klaus. So whatever. Klaus is driving down with his floppy piece of fucking sheet metal, and he almost hits this other... Wait, no. What happens here? <laughs> <laughs> but I did forget to mention, as, you know, they're... As I did forget to mention, as it's being fuck, and I, as I did fuck, fuck, fuck. What the hell is wrong with you? And I did forget to mention, and I did forget to mention that. <laughs> you <laughs> say you. Over time. Well, because you keep making faces, and then people are gonna look and be like, "What? What I'm the hell's going on?" Why not? You're trying to get it out, but yeah. you, you were tired. Take a breath and say it.